I used to do eBay years ago. Yeah, I mean, I, obviously I do eBay, but yeah. What would you want for all of them? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven there. Seventy, ninety, and eighty quid the lot. Seventy. Hey everybody, we are at a church tabletop sale today, aren't we, dear? Yes. What's the church name? Let's give them some free advertising. The Church of the Holy Spirit. There we go. In Prestatin. <laughs> yeah. Um, we have been here before. We came when your mum was visiting once. Yes, we have been before. Um, so we're going to go in and see what we can find. More Christmas stuff. What have you got in your dime, man? Two pounds. Power's on it. Yeah. The battery's still working. Okay. So four on that, two on that. Yeah. About your Muppet shows? Uh, £5, well, £20 a set. And about 25 quid each, 20 to 25 on eBay. Hmm. you got some cool stuff. Yeah, I'm just, I've had it for years, 30 odd years. I've just, I've got fed, I just keep moving from house to house. I've just got to well, tell me what, yeah, tell me about that. A lot of people won't know about it. It's on, it's underneath the table. American choppers on the floor. People won't know about Orange County choppers. Oh, right, yeah. How much have you got on your choppers? Ten pound each. The big one up here. These, these, these go, they're on eBay for 250, but no one bids on them. No. It's, 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 I mean, you can list things at whatever you want, but yeah, it's but what that, it sells no, for. That's uh, the thing, uh, isn't it? I think, no way. How much is your belt buckle? Pound. Right, we're on. I've got another one there. Oh, have you? An Orange County one there. Is that a pound? Yeah. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Oh. These look good though, don't they? Yeah, they're good. They're good. Unless you're into that sort of thing. I've got the next ones as well. All brand new. Would you do 15 on the four of those? Yeah? So that's 23, I owe you. Okay. How much are you breaking bads? A uh, pound each. That's 25. Your bubble head? Two pound. Twenty-seven. <laughs> this guy? Twenty-eight. Doing well here, aren't we? Yeah. Like guitar picks in there. Oh, that's neat, like, isn't it? Like guitar, you go. Slides. Oh, it slides. How cool is that? How much are these? A couple of quid each. I bought them from when I see, see the Eagles years ago. What's the other one? Uh, that one is Ernie Ball. Oh, just the yeah, just Ernie Ball. Yeah, the Eagles. One I, went, I went to see the Eagles live. Nice. Then, uh, You do a pound each on those, make that 30. Oh, you've got so much cool stuff. I see, I think it's a USB stick and all pictures and stuff. Oh, is that what it is? How much for those two? Three pound. 33. I've got some bits in here I haven't put on the table. Just a bit. Badge. You can have that if you want it. Oh, thank you very much. We're on 33 at the minute, aren't we? Yet? 
Load of trading cards. What are they? They're just Orange County choppers again. Okay. Load of them. Oh, I made them. Cool. Oh, and a poker chip. Nice. How much for your bits here? Your cards and your chip and your um, and your Iron Maidens. Three pound. Yeah, thirty six. Thirty six, eh? Thirty six. Thirty six. Lovely. Right. Yeah. Thank you very much. Cheers. Thanks for the table. Yeah, you can uh, put a few more bits on. I'll have a think about your uh, choppers. Yeah. So what you got on these? A tenner each. Yeah, I'll have a deal though if you buy. You're a dealer yeah. for buy a few. They're um, on about. They go. They're, people. They're advertised for about twenty-five on eBay. Okay. Um, oh, that's just. Uh, I was going to put it in a caravan. It's just a radio. It's oh, very right. thin. Yeah. Just, just gonna, uh... Okay. Yeah, lovely. Thank you very much. That's great. What is it? I still don't know what it is. It's a light up picture. Okay. How much are these two, please? It's a pound for both. Pound for both. I'll take those, thank you. That, that was working. This the one? Alpha, the big one. Yeah. Um, I think, did we take the batteries out? Oh, it's all it right. It's in the toy box. It kept, when, the, when the head tips up, it makes like a big roar. Right. How much is your DVD set, please? Come back. I've got um, oh, that's that's my bag. That oh, one. It's all right. It's fine. Never put your bag down. Sale. <laughs> yeah. Four pound. That one. Okay. What about this one? That will be the same. It's five films. So. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. How much is your set? Oh, I just kept the Two pounds? Yeah. Go on, I'll take those, thank you. There you go. Okay. Cheers. <laughs> Lovely, thank you very much indeed. How is Amelia? <laughs> My husband won't, she should come around to the meeting. Yeah. That's why I bought it. Yeah. <laughs> Can't beat a bit of irritation. Yeah, of course. The thing is, because I just dropped that dog across there, when I go home now, I've got a lap of dog, and she, she can smell a dog on it. She literally, if she gets on the bed, turns around, faces the wall, and what I've anything to do with yeah. her now. Go to a sulk. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I always said it was a fire in the squad and we'd have the meeting dogs, they'd have them stand a chance, they'd know you're right, you wouldn't. <laughs> 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 yeah, some interesting mugs. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 
Morning. I'll have these blues at yeah. two, four, six there. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. How much does she need? <laughs> Isn't that right? Yeah, yeah that's brilliant. Thank you very much indeed. I'm going to think it might be general. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Forgot about Are these 50p as yeah, well? Three, three for a pound. Three for a pound, okay. Yeah. It's one. Yeah, but I gave you five pounds. Oh, did you? Yeah, yeah. I've just included that. <laughs> I've just included that. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. <laughs> I just don't want to knock that off. No, you're right. Uh, I'll take those three, please. Yeah, quite enough. So it's 25. I've no, no idea what they are. They're the big glass things. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think you're on it there. I just had a quick look. There's the 25. There's a few that are up for 25. Yeah. It's just that I just can't. I used to do eBay years ago. Yeah, I mean, I, obviously I do eBay, but yeah. So how many you got? Two, four, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, that's yeah. What would you want for all of them? Uh, what is? How many is this? So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven there. Seventy, hundred, eighty quid the lot. Seventy. Yeah. Can you hang on to them for me until I finish? Yeah, of course I can. Yeah, I'll put them back. Lovely. Got some little baby ones. Well, that's it for the tabletop sale here at the uh, Church of the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Um, and I bought quite a lot in one store. I spent over a hundred pound on one store, which is uh, which is quite a lot. Tabletop. That's a lot for a tabletop sale, isn't it? Right, let's get back and we'll show you what we picked up. Hey, we're back from the tabletop sale at the church, and it's one of them sales where you know, like one table sort of saves a day kind of but i put a lot from one table over a hundred pound on one table and as you can see quite a bit of stuff really from a little small uh sort of tabletop sale but i've been a couple of times and i always pick up stuff there so let's see what we got here we are quite a bit of stuff to get through let's start down here we got some muppets corgis there's no way i'm leaving these behind i absolutely love the muppets and uh, these are cool. I got these four corgis for £15. I think they are worth roughly, give or take, roughly sort of £20 a piece. Um, now, lots of little smalls, which is good. I like smalls. And let's go for this Dymo printer. I always pick these up when I see them. They tend to go cheap and... They tend to command sort of £20-ish. Um, I think I paid about £2 for this one. You might know you saw it in the video, perhaps. Uh, I think it's worth roughly around £20. I don't think I've had this model before, so I'm not 100% sure, but going off previous sales. Now, look at this. This is cool. It's a Pez um, Orange County Choppers, American Choppers type thing. Uh, nice metal box, collector's box. I think this was £4 and actually could be worth about 30 that some good money in this american chopper stuff now look at this tiny little Ayrton senna figure i think this was a pound or two pound um but that could actually be worth about 30 believe it or not i'm gonna just give it a clean over as you can see it's a bit dusty but yeah nice pickup uh, status, I don't even know what this is. Status quo pictures. Oh, is it? I think he said it was a USB stick or something with pictures on it. Uh, what did I pay for this? Like a pound or something? Like very, very small amount. I have written all these in my accounts, by the way, but I can't remember now what it was. 
Uh, it's like one pound or something like that. Um, maybe ten to fifteen on that. Ten pound maybe. Uh, now these are cool. These are guitar picks, and this is the history of the Eagles guitar pick set from two thousand and thirteen. Um, can I get it open? Is it a slider? Yeah, it's got all these different guitar guitar picks. Um, and this set, limited edition, Ernie Ball fiftieth anniversary. All the picks inside. Look, isn't that cool? I uh, paid a pound each on those. Uh, actually, these could be worth maybe fifteen, twenty pound. I don't know about the trading cards. I just took them as part of a sort of little bundle deal. I didn't want to leave them behind. I think they worked out like one or two pound. And I don't know the value, to be honest. I've done no research on these. So I'll I'll just job lot them together. I'm not going to be looking for any... Probably not looking for any cards in there that, you know, might be worth something. I don't know. But I'll just job lot those, probably. Uh, let's move across. I have no idea what this figure is, or this one. Um, but it was two for a pound. And I just thought I'd try it out and see see what they were. I don't know what it is. If you know, drop a comment, please. That would be useful. But at 50p each, not a clue. I've not Google imaged them yet. I will Google lens them. And this one as well. Looks like something like out of Star Wars or something like that. Um, so, yeah, again, 50p. But I've not checked, checked those out as yet. I've got so much stuff this weekend. Um, I've got three little Harley Davidson, little miniature uh, motorbikes as you can see there Harley on the side uh, I don't know if they're official Harley or what but um, the guy was obviously a, a chopper sort of collector type thing uh, three for a pound I couldn't leave them behind I'll probably keep them as a bundle and just sell them together price wise mm, I don't know maybe 20 pound or something like that uh, this um, Paul Jr a uh, little minifigure could be worth about £15. I think I I got like a pound on it or something, £2. Now, what year is that? 2004. So, if I wait a year, that's vintage. Um, he gave me this uh, pin badge for free. Mikey for president. Uh, I'll have to look at that. There's an Orange County Choppers um, poker chip. I think it was like a quid, along with the Iron Maiden things. I think that's that could be worth about £15, believe it or not. Um, Iron Maiden, really nice sort of beer mats. Don't know if these have got any age or if these are modern or what. But they look nice, don't they? If you like that kind of thing. Um, but yeah, they they kind of came with it. Uh, so value on those, unsure at the moment. I know there's a lot of unsures on this one, but uh, so much stuff to deal with at the moment. Uh, to, I've got these three um, Blu-rays, all 3Ds. Geostorm 3D, um, 300 3D, and Terminator Genesis 3D. That These will all just go in my collection because I like collecting the 3D ones. And I paid a pound for the three, so can't grumble at that, can you? Um, these two are obviously Breaking Bad. Um, Toonstar Toys. I have had Toonstar, Toonstar Toys before. A uh, bit of a rip-off of Breaking Bad. I don't think, by the looks of it, it doesn't look like they're allowed to actually say it's Breaking Bad. But come on, we all know they've got... I've got Back to the Future ones there, number threes. I've got big ones of those. Um, but look at this one. Doesn't he remind you of, what's his name, the TV presenter with the teeth? What's his name? Oh, I can't think of it. You'll know. Yeah, I'll be having people comment now, won't I? Comment if you know his name. You know what I mean, though. Um, I paid £2 for this vintage Domino's set. It says it's all urea pieces. I don't even know what urea is. I'll have to look that up. With metal spin. Um, so £2 paid. And it's in this nice plastic box. It's got its instructions. Uh, all the pieces look pretty nice. Oh, apart from that one, obviously. <laughs> um, 
I think it's worth about 15 to 20 pound. Something like that. Now, I like picking up belt buckles. I've got these two Orange County choppers. I don't think these are... They're obviously not old because it's based on Orange County choppers, but they're not vintage. But they're still cool. Look at that one. Electrician. Could be an electrician out there interested in that belt buckle. <laughs> um, these worked out at sort of like a pound or two pound each, and I think we could get about 20 each back on those. Now, I've got a load of mugs, and these were 50p each. So that was three pound for these six mugs. And um, what did we get? We got, I think they're all vintage in some way, Kuala Lumpur 98 Commonwealth Games. So 90s mug. Um, what else have we got here? Oh, ooh, boo. Manchester United, 93-94. I'm sure we'll be able to move it. Um, USA, Winter, I think it's Winter Olympics, Lake Placid, 1980. Oh, hang on a minute. Limited edition. You can't grumble with these vintage mugs at, like, 50p each. You really can't. Um, the Ashes, 2005. What's this one? Uh, Commonwealth Games, Scotland, 1986. And this one is Wimbledon 2005 mug. So, yeah, I think I did all right with those mugs. And I got these um, two books for £5. American Choppers, that's just a paperback book. I don't think that's got much value, just a few quid. Uh, this one's worth a little bit more. But look at the book, it's nice. It's got this sort of emblem thing on here. And it's got all kinds of stuff in it. Uh, but I just thought that looked like a real nice book. I didn't check any of this stuff. You just kind of get an inkling that it's going to have some value. Um, so £5 for those two. I'm thinking 15 to 20 on, And I'm going to probably just keep them together just for the sake of uh, that one being not worth like that much. Now, now before we get on to all the big choppers, I also picked up this guy. And I've just realised that I actually haven't researched this prior to the video. So I'm not sure what this one's worth. Mikey taking out the trash. Uh, bobblehead. Oops, limited edition. Uh, he has got a little bit of damage on his side there underneath his hair, can you see? Not immediately obvious, but I have to describe that. And it will affect its value to somewhat. But yeah, he's got to be worth something. I think he was like £2, so definite value in that. Now, okay, let's get to the elephant in the room which is these uh one two three four five six seven nine choppers um they are from the series american choppers um the boxes are a little bit worn there is damage to the boxes which is a real shame but um discovery channel there each one is different some are worth more than others um, it is a shame that the boxes are a little bit damaged, but we did do a bundle deal on these. This is a bigger one, worth a little bit more. And that one's a slightly different box design. Uh, I paid £70 for these nine choppers. Um, 70 quid. So what does that work out at? About £8, eight pound each, is it? Something like that. Around £8 each. And I think we're looking at minimum 25 each on them on eBay. Um, but that will vary depending on each one. Each one's got its own value. These two possibly worth a bit more. Some of them go up to sort of £40. And um, these two may be a little bit more than that. So I think money's safe at £8 a piece. And I couldn't leave them behind. Um, I bought a lot of stuff off the guy. So I really appreciate if you do happen to be watching, I really appreciate the deal. Thank you. And we'll find some new homes for these things. That's it for today. It was a good tabletop sale. Highly recommend that. And um, I will ping up on the side here a couple of videos that might interest you. 
um, some boot sale videos and whatnot. Um, but feel free, go binge on the channel. It's always good to go through and get some views on some other videos. So it's really appreciated. Give us a subscribe, give us a thumbs up, and we'll see you soon. Take care.